Hi, I'm Rebecca Farnham, a 2012 Marshall Scholar, currently studying a Master's in Science in Water Security and International Development at the University of East Anglia, and this is Ramblings with Rebecca. Episode 1, The Rules. Uh, so this project was thought up a couple of weeks ago and has been bouncing around in my head. Uh, you see, I'm one of those people who's like on social media but doesn't actually use social media. So like I have a Twitter and I have an Instagram. I have Facebook and I do use my Facebook. But like Twitter, Instagram, LinkedIn, all of these things on them. Very, very rarely touch them. Go through like two days of like Twitter, 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 and then like never touch it again. Very rarely read it. That kind of thing. And a while ago I was at a conference and someone was like, hey, are you on social media? I was like, well, yes but there's no point in following me because I never do anything with it. And this summer, when I am writing my senior, no, not my senior, oh God, that was undergraduate. When I'm reading my, writing my thesis for my master's, it seems like a good opportunity to spice up the day a bit, talking to someone other than my computer and myself. Although I guess technically that's really what I'm doing now. I'm just hoping eventually someone else listens to it about what's going on in my head. So I'm just going to ramble for a bit every day at a webcam and see what comes out of it. The thought is that I'll talk about the kinds of topics that I'm doing and exploring while writing my thesis and doing other things. So it may be international water law, it may be constructivism or feminism, political ecology, environmental determinism, slow foods, NGOs, genetically modified crops, the Arab Spring, land grabs. Who knows what, whatever pops into my head for the day, that's what I'm going to spend five minutes talking about. So, actually getting to the title of this, the rules. Here's how these things are going to work. Number one, no editing. What I say in the five minutes while I'm recording goes online, regardless of how stupid or inane it makes me sound. This is a little alarming, but hey, I believe in honesty. It will be fun. Also, I don't really know how to do editing, as you can probably tell. I mean. I could, but this way we can just have more fun. It'll be more personal. Whatever. Lag of editing. Nothing fancy. On the nothing fancy. Number two, no fancy equipment. I have me. I have a Mac, which is actually my brother's old Mac, so thanks, Bubba. I have an extra lamp stolen from my flatmate to help make sure that I'm not completely in the dark. And the camera is currently in my, is like the built-in webcam on the Mac and is sitting on the one chair I have in my room, and I am actually sitting on the upside down rubbish bin. That's garbage can for you Americans. So seriously, nothing fancy. Here we go. What you see is what you get. Okay, so no editing, no fancy equipment. Number three, five minutes, five minutes only, for the full five minutes. The camera rolls for five minutes. At the end of that five minutes, even if I'm mid-word, <laughs> what's getting uploaded is only at the five minute mark. We'll see go really well or really badly. I don't know if you all have ever given a presentation but it's like three minutes feels like a really long time and then suddenly you're in front of people and three minutes is no time at all. So we'll see how five minutes goes. Some of these conversations and topics that I'll probably be getting into can't really be covered in five minutes. So I may do some two-parters but it will be five minutes a day, no more no less. That's only five minutes of my time because really I'm basically just uploading, like recording these and instantly uploading, editing. Also a time saver. Yeah, five minutes of my, your time, five minutes of my time. Here we go. And finally, rule number four, and the last one. Each day, I name a starting topic, probably the main topic that I've already been reading and writing on for that day, and I ramble for five minutes. Who knows what will happen, or be realized, or miscommunicated, or really uncertain, or hey, who knows? I might learn something, you might learn something, in the five minutes that I chatter. The goal is that hopefully this gets me to think about how I explain things, how I think through things. If you haven't learned anything at the end of the five minutes, then you comment and you tell me what I have wrong about topic X of the day. Who knows what I'll find through this whole thing, who knows what you will. Maybe my mother will even be able to figure out what it is that I study at the end of all this. We'll see. So I am coming up on the four minutes and forty second mark, which leaves me with a grand total of fifteen seconds to say. Looking forward to it. God only knows what the summer is going to bring. Uh, have fun on this journey with me. I really kind of pity you, whoever you are out there watching, but hey, who knows? Hopefully it'll be fun.